to the channel. Today I teased on another video to tell you about my other jacket I occasionally wear which is more for those sort of retro riders. It's the RST Instate 3 jacket I've got. Now obviously I'm currently riding MT-07 but when I bought this jacket I was looking at the modern modern classics hence why I've got it. Um, my next bike more likely to be a modern classic um, we'll see how I get along with the uh, test rides. Now I've got the new boots from the previous video. Anyway, today I thought I'd just go over, give you a bit of a owner's overview of this jacket because I have worn it for the, on and off for the last year, year and a half, and it's been absolutely awesome. Anyway, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe for more uh, reviews and bike reviews uh, going forward. Right. Cameras flip round, so here you go. Here's the uh, RST Instastate 3 jacket in all its former glory. Now, they make this jacket with uh, proper cowhide RST dudes, about 1.3 mil thick, if I remember rightly. I'll put all the links in the description of uh, the jacket in full details. But just for a quick, quick short overview, as you can see, a bit of fly splatter. I do need to give it a clean, so sorry about that, guys. Probably should have done it before, Andy. Um, obviously, starting with like the sleeves, you've got the sips on the on the sleeves here, so you can keep keep it nice and uh, nice and snug with your gloves. You've got yeah, your pockets here, here, there, and there, and the arms, the elbow, sorry, and the shoulders. I've got C the C E uh, one protection as standard. These are interchangeable, so you can um, put the C E two armor in if you need to um i've got that in my other jacket which actually with rst a lot of rst jackets you can just swap across um it's quite a lot heavier than the standard sort of textile jackets as you can imagine um but yeah this one's got winter lining in which i'll show you now the power of youtube one two three go and by the power of youtube there you go it's unsipped but yeah as you can see it's got a nice winter lining in um, it only goes halfway down the sleeves. However, I, I find this has been absolutely fine. You've got, got an inside pocket there, so keep like your phone or whatever in. As you can see, it's uh, part of the RST Classic uh, collection. This is obviously I'm a size 42, um, and yeah, you can have a little pocket inside there, so can't really fit too much in there. Probably your phone again if you really wanted to. You've got another pocket there. And as I said, with the uh, armour, there's your C C1 uh, back protector. Now, you, it's Falcro at the top here. I don't know if you can see it up there. So basically you can take that out and replace it. Obviously all this uh, winter lining just simply sips out like all the RST jackets. But yeah, it's nice and warm, even in, in the winter conditions. Um, and it's a nice thick, like I said, 1.3 mil leather high jacket you got your fastener at the top and all in all in a nutshell yeah it's a good solid jacket if you look after it you, it'll just keep going for a long time right and here's me wearing it once again power of youtube forgot to say on the back of the jacket you've got the sip connection so if you've got like the rst pants you can sip sip it up so it's more like a one piece if you wanted to i just wear it with my jeans um so I don't don't bother doing any of that, but yeah, it sits sits nicely. Obviously, being a short rider, I'm sort of medium medium build, you know, with arms and stuff, perfect for myself. And um, there's your shoulder protections. It's nice. So you've got your elbow, and obviously you've got your your back protection. You do feel a bit more like a Mitchley man with your wide uh, wide shoulders, but I think it goes with the uh, goes with the look of like the vintage jacket. Uh, I was going to take these off because they are kind of like dangle and they do kind of annoy me but I've kind of got used to them now and to be fair when doing up your your gloves and stuff like that you know you know you just literally pull that even if you put your gloves on already on both hands so yeah good solid jacket like I said I've used it on and off I've probably done quite a few probably, I'll probably say I've done like two two and a half thousand miles probably wearing this jacket and even on my MT-07, <laughs> I just like it, it's, it's really, really good, it's really warm, um, it's nice and soft, and it just feels a bit more bolstered 
a bit more heavier duty than my uh, my textile jackets I've got. However, yeah, I did promise you I'd do your review on this. Um, I think this is an older model one now, and um, there's obviously the different Insta-state Insta Insta uh, jackets. However, yeah, if, if you're looking for one, yeah, you can't go far wrong with RST, if you ask me. So, yeah, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. You said help the help my growing channel and I'll look forward to the next video which will come next week and um, yeah then blah 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 see you later guys cheers